My name is Juliana Greenwich. I'm 19 and I'm from Brooklyn, New York. There are TV shows and movies that glamorize suicide and it's not something to be glamorized at all. Like it's scary and it's a very serious matter that should be talked about in depth and for everyone to know that it's not the answer. Like no matter how hopeless you feel, it will never be the answer. Suicide is a permanent solution to a temporary problem and you have someone out there who loves you. I promise you that. I feel like the unstoppable gives a true in-depth meaning to mental health and suicide awareness and I just want to share that with people so we can actually start a real conversation. Put a stamp. I feel it coming. The thick, dark, putrid substance leaked from the pipe so I'd confined it to. I held my breath, hoping that if I didn't swallow the poison, the carpet is stamp. I feel it coming. The thick, dark, putrid substance leaked from the pipe so I'd confined it to. What you writing, Lottie? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a poem I've been working on. Can I hear it? Um, it's not really good, and it's not even done yet. I'm sure it'll be great. You have to have more confidence, Lots. It's not that simple. The last time I did this, everyone laughed, so... <laughs> That's because you were dressed like a horse. What's the... All right. It was a unicorn. Horse unicorn, nobody really gives a shit. And you know, I meant to ask you today, what the fuck do you think you're wearing? Hey, Mercedes, blow a chainsaw. Kiss my ass. Okay, let's stay focused. Um, can I get a volunteer to read the quote from the board? How about you, Gemma? Confront the dark parts of yourself and work to banish them with illumination and forgiveness. Your willingness to wrestle with your demons will cause your angels to sing. August Wilson. Okay, can anyone interpret the quote? Ruth, perfect. Uh, it means you have to have positivity. Absolutely. Let's build on Ruth's idea. Anyone else? Great, Lottie, good. Um, I think it means that you have to be brave enough to face your fears and accept yourself for who you are, even when other people don't understand, and that to truly love yourself, <laughs> Nobody has to hear your whole life. Mercedes, you know we do not tolerate disrespect in this classroom. I'm just... I'm... Sorry, Lottie. Continue. Okay, so let's transition to independent work. Let's write our responses to this quote in our notebook. Mercedes, get out. I didn't even out. That. Now. You okay, Lottie? Why don't you stay in class? Lottie. Mom, I'm home. I'm in the kitchen. How was school? Fine. Watch it, dork. Wow, what's for food? I'm starving. I ordered takeout. Okay. Louie, out of the fridge. Mom, can I talk to you alone? Whatever. Lottie, I'm really swamped right now. Can it wait? What's wrong? I 
think there's something wrong with me. Um, I can't concentrate. I can't sleep. Oh my God, Lottie, are you pregnant? What? Mom, no. Uh, are you on drugs? Mom! Okay, well, if you're not on drugs and you're not pregnant, then what's the problem? I can't explain it. One minute, I'm okay. Then the next, the slightest thing can trigger me and then it's like I can't breathe. <gasps> Lottie, you scared me. I thought this was something serious. It's normal. You're a teenager. Your hormones are all over the place. You're just being dramatic. I don't think that's it. You're fine. Other people are much worse off. Okay, just think happy thoughts. It's like saying I shouldn't be happy because other people have it better. God, I wish Dad was here. Lottie. Carpet is damp. I feel it coming. The thick, dark, putrid substance. You mind explaining why I'm getting a call from your teacher saying that you stormed out of class today? Oh, um. Did they even tell you why? Just ignore her, Lottie. She's not important. Is that what's bothering you? Why didn't you tell me? You wouldn't get it. Why, because I wasn't a teenager? No, because you wouldn't understand. It's so much more than that, Mom, and I'm tired of you saying that you care and nothing. I'm tired of you not giving a Watch who you're talking to. I am still your mother. You don't see that I'm doing everything that I can? I'm sorry, it's just, you get upset when I get upset, and it's just a big mess. We'll talk about this later. Put a stamp. I feel it coming. The thick, dark, putrid substance leaked from the pipe so I'd confined it to. I held my breath, hoping that if I didn't swallow the poison, the carpet is stamp. I feel it coming. I feel it coming. The thick, Dark, putrid substance leaked from the pipe so I can find it too. I held my breath. It's like the fifth day though. And there's no food in the house. All right, but they only giving me till tomorrow to pay my senior dues. If I don't pay them, like, I can't walk with everybody for graduation. going to Lex's house. Like, I don't want a family feeling bad for me. It's all right, I'm just, I'm gonna call you later. Yeah, I'm all right, love you too. <laughs> Mercedes, you in here? What's good, Lex? You good? Yeah, my makeup look good. Yeah. I was trying to fix it. Yeah, it's Let good. Me see if Everything okay? Lex, you know that girl, um, she be wearing the, uni the unicorn outfits? Yeah. She be looking like shit. Wait, what? <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I think her father left because she's a embarrassment. Anyway, we could go. Alright, let's go. S smells like horse Mom? Bowie? Bowie? Put a 
is stamp. I feel it coming. Carpet is stamp. I feel it coming. Carpet is stamp. I feel it coming. Carpet is stamp. I feel it coming. Hey, Ma, I don't know where she's at. I'm not her babysitter. Lottie? Hold on one second. Lottie, open up. Mom wants to talk to you. Lottie, open up. Mom wants to talk to you. Demons I can't keep away You are my light In the darkest of rooms You are the one I can't afford to lose Cause the world Can be such a cruel Place but the Sun will shine as long as I see your face Your smile gives me hope Your heart is my home You make me feel like I'm not alone You. Don't you ever put your hands on me again. She never did anything to you. Aw, what are you going to think about? You're just a sad, hateful person. I feel sorry for you. Leave me alone, both of you. Oh, like you left Lottie alone? I spoke to the doctor again today. 72 hours is officially up. She's getting better? She is. But Louis, we need to be there for her more, even when she's out. Listen, word spreads fast, and there are some parents at your school that don't think it's appropriate for her to come back. She can't come back? Are you kidding me? Of course she can go back, but they just don't think that it would be the the PTA, Ma! That's your daughter! Stand up for her! First of all, watch your tone. It was just a discussion, and I didn't want to cause a scene. No wonder why Lottie thought she had no one to turn to. Dad's not here. You don't even listen. You know something? I don't care who you blame, but don't you dare blame me. I am trying my hardest. It's not about you, Ma! This is about Lottie! We have to help her. We cannot let her down. Or else, what's going to stop her from doing it again? No. I hear you. I hear you. Okay, okay. Looking good, sis. How many drugs they got you on? <laughs> None, actually. It's just group therapy and being around people like me. That's good. You know, uh, Gemma and Ruth were trying to call you, right? Yeah, I know. It's just, um, I don't think I'm ready to talk to them about this yet. Everyone's probably already talking about it at school. I got you. If anything, I can say you went to Denver to visit Aunt Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> Noted.
Like, anyone's going to believe that. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well have a huge sign on my face. Reads crazy. Uh, you're not crazy. Mom? Hi. <laughs> Hi. I brought uni. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, Louie, can you give your sister and me a moment? Whatever, I know when I'm not wanted. Peace out, sis. <laughs> See you. <laughs> okay. Charlotte, I'm, uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I wasn't there for you, especially after your father left. You and your brother are my entire world. And I am a mother first. And I should have never let you down. But I need you to know that I'm here if you ever need to talk. I love you, Mom. And I'm sorry too, you know. You're doing this all by yourself, and we don't exactly make it easy for you, clearly. No, you don't. <laughs> Hold on a second. What are you doing? Hi, this is Joanna Williams, Lottie's mom. I wanted to let you know that Lottie will absolutely be coming back. And I really don't much care who has a problem with it. Thank you. And you have a great rest of your day. What was that about? That was about you knowing that whenever you need me, I will always be here for you. I will always protect you. But I want you to know something. I want you to know that when I'm not there, you're strong enough to protect yourself. I'm beautiful, unique, talented. <laughs> Lottie, you deserve to be heard. No, I need to get my nails done. Hold on, check this out. Huh? Did you know where I was? Uh, no, no, no. Do you even care? I, I no, 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 no. You're gonna let me finish. You don't like something about yourself, so you project your shitty negativity onto me. I may be odd, I might dress funny, I might not fit in whatever mold you think I should, but I'll be damned if I ever let you or anyone else make me feel bad about it. Listen. Sorry. You never did anything to me. You just irritate me. You walk around like you don't care about what anybody thinks. You walk around with a horse costume. It's a unicorn. That. You got a mom. You got friends. You got a brother. They care about you. They love you. You know where my mom is? She in jail. I don't got nothing. <laughs> Listen, I started writing poems to help me deal with whatever it was I was going through. 
I made these one day, mainly because I was bored, but um, they're like my escape. Maybe you can find yours too, you know, instead of interrupting Mr. P's class. It mean like somebody said he got RBF. <laughs> Resting bitch face. <laughs> you are right. So are you. We're here for you, Lottie. Yeah, if they laugh at you, they laugh at all of us, so. <laughs> the carpet is damp. I feel it coming. The thick, dark, putrid substance leaked from the pipes I had confined it to. I held my breath, hoping that if I didn't swallow the poison, maybe it wouldn't grow inside me again. Then it comes. But this time, this time, it goes right through me. Why stop cause it don't know? Don't stop cause it won't grow. It's the pain you wanna let go. There ain't no mind to the low blows. Why stop cause it don't know? Don't stop cause it won't grow. It's the pain you wanna let go. There ain't no mind to the low blows.